Welcome to the Laughing Horror News Show, brought to you by the Laughing Horror Podcast. Today is Friday, May 12th, and these are your horror headlines from the past few days. Hatchet is celebrating 10 years, and Aries Scope is helping fans join along in the celebration with a handful of merchandise, featuring new artwork from Ralph Kroos. Items include shirts, hoodies, and an actual print of the artwork itself. All of the items are available from merchandise.goody.com with shipping of the product starting in early June. Doug Bradley, after 14 years, has decided to don the pinhead makeup one more time. Don't get overexcited, however, as it is not for a film role, but for a photo op event, which is to take place at the Mad Monster Party in Arizona from May 19th to the 21st. Tickets are going on for are on sale for $260 a piece, but a single one can be used for up to four guests for the photo op as well as signatures, according to Bradley. They're uh, also building a special set with lights, music, uh, without green screen, and uh, the best of all, a working lament configuration. So if you are in the area, definitely try to check that out. Uh, get a few friends together and uh, pull your money to get in on that. The television adaptation of Mr. Mercedes now has a premiere date. August 9th will be the opener for, for the series based on the Stephen King book. I have not uh, spent much time talking about this in the past, so here's the synopsis. Mr. Mercedes follows a demented killer who taunts a retired police detective with a series of lured e- letters and emails, forcing the ex-cop to undertake a private and potentially fel- felonious crusade to bring the killer to justice before he's able to strike again. Speaking to Stephen King about bit of casting news for Castle Rock, they have casted the lead for the series in Andre Holland, who will play a death row attorney. Holland has been uh, best known thus far from his film Mi- uh, Moonlight, as well as American Horror Story uh, Rock. Beyond the Gates, which has just had its Blu-ray release last week, is now available in a different format. Thanks to Lo-Fi Video, you can purchase the film on VHS. The cost you as $30 plus shipping. So if this is something that interests you, that you need to add to your collection, you can purchase it at lofivideo.storenvy.com. American Gods has been renewed for a second season after only having two episodes air. I've actually just started reading the book today, and I have to say I've been enjoying it thus far. And I'm looking forward to checking out the series once I'm through with the book. Additionally, CW has renewed both iZombie as well as the originals, um, each for an, uh, an additional season. Well, Fox has decided to cancel Sleepy Hollow, and as of this report, are still keeping us in the dark about a potential second season for The Exorcist. So I guess in this scenario, no news is good news. So with that being said and done, guys, I do appreciate you uh, tuning in to the Laughing Horror News Show. If you'd like to check out the podcast or any of our social media pages, you can do so by checking out the uh, links in the description. Thank you all for tuning in to the Laughing Horror News Show, and we we will talk to you guys on Monday.